Did you know that every single story in the Bible is true? That's right, it's true. So the story we learned about today, about Moses going to Pharaoh and saying, let God's people go, and Pharaoh saying no, and Pharaoh said no a lot. So God sent plagues, and some of them were really icky, huh? There were frogs and grasshoppers and some of the animal and people got sick, but that's enough about the Bible story. Guess what time it is? It's time to color. So I have my marker and my piece of paper. Now I'm gonna make an animal sound and I want you to guess what it is. Ready? Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Do you have a guess? <gasps> Not a sheep. What was that? <gasps> oh, you're right. It was a frog. So we are going to draw a frog, okay? So take your marker and at the top of your page, I want you to draw an M or two mountains, okay? So let's see, here's one, go up and down. And then our second one, and then stop. Oh, good job. Now right here in the middle of it, I want you to draw a circle, okay? So here's my circle. All right, good job. So now friends, in our second mountain, let's draw another circle. There you go. Do you guys have any guess what we're drawing so far? You're right, we're drawing eyes. So now for our eyes, we're gonna draw a second circle in each one, but we're gonna color it in this time, okay? So draw an eye, and now color it in. And look, my frog has green eyes, how cool is that? And you can use whatever color you want for your frog. You could use pink, or blue, or orange, or you could use green like me. All right, there we go. Hmm, it kind of looks like a frog. Not yet though, we need to finish it. For my frog, I'm gonna draw a big smile, okay? This is a happy frog, he has lots of food to eat. Big smile, but just not a smile. He also has his tongue hanging out. <laughs> he has his tongue hanging out also. So right here, I want you to go down and come back around and up. And that's gonna be our tongue, okay? So draw down, and he has a really long tongue. You see that? And come back down and around and up. And then draw a line down the middle, because it's a tongue. It's a tongue. What do you guys think? All right, you guys are doing so good. And remember, if at any point you need help, raise your hand, and your parent or your teacher will come help, okay? Now let's finish our frog. We need to finish drawing his head. So right here, where we started, we're gonna come down, go around, stop at the tongue, pick up our pen and then start on the other side, okay? Because we don't want to drop through our tongue and we're going to come up and we're going to finish the head. So here we go, go down and around and stop. Pick up your marker, go to the other side and then keep drawing up back to the line. There you go. <laughs> That's a cool frog, huh? And look at how big he is. He could eat a lot of flies. All right, can I see yours? Oh, I love the color you used. Good job. Ooh, that is a big frog. All right, friends, can you go ribbit, ribbit, ribbit? <laughs> so cool, friends. Well, that's all we have for today, okay? So, bye, friends.